In the Perot Museum videos promoting the total eclipse, astronomers admit they are downright giddy about all of this. I'm super excited about the eclipse. Uh, John Mulcahy, for one, with the Carnegie Science Center in Pittsburgh, who will be with us at the Perot Museum next month. It's very hard to describe. It's almost like a religious experience. People are going to be very uh, excited. It'll be one of the highlights of their life, I think, in many cases. People so excited that hotels across Texas in the eclipse path from San Antonio to Sulphur Springs are booking up fast. The Dallas Omni with special room rates and a viewing party near the outdoor Pegasus. Airlines like Southwest and JSX offering flights directly in the totality path. It is a once in a every 200 year phenomena. The CEO of Visit Dallas says they used a previous event in Nashville as an estimate. And in doing that, we have been able to determine that we are expecting about a 35% increase in overnight visitation compared to previous years on a typical Monday in April. But in all this excitement, there is also concern. Bell County in Central Texas issuing an April 8th disaster declaration because they're expecting the population to double. Schools in Kaufman County declaring a school holiday for that same reason. Kaufman County predicting 200,000 extra eclipse tourists that day and all the traffic headaches that come with them. But as the Perot clock counts down, astronomers say get ready. The next one won't be till 2317, so that's quite a long time uh, to wait. So whether excited or concerned, this is your only Texas chance. In Dallas, I'm Kevin Reese.